So we're able to use lots of the insights from cognitive neuroscience to help us communicate more effectively with our consumers. And we're able to do this first by testing how people respond to advertising, to any kind of messaging. And then also taking all those learnings that we have over the last decades about what makes effective advertising to help improve that advertising. So one of the best capabilities that we have is ad compressions. So we're able to take a 60 second ad and cut it down to a 30 second ad by using our second by second brainwave analysis. So we're able to isolate the neurological high points within any ad, take those out um, and isolate those so we have a, a half the length ad which is as effective, if not more effective than the original length and clearly represents a big saving in media spend. We work across um, all different sectors, all different industries. We test print, digital, TV, any kind of stimuli. So I wouldn't want to say which one is going to be more effective. They can all be effective and ineffective, used correctly or incorrectly.